Hi everyone. In this lecture, we are going to solve a numericals that are based on information. And this is part first video of the numericals. So here is the question number first. A source produces one of the four messages during each interval. Having the probabilities p of x1 equals to 1 by 2, p of x2 equals to 1 by 4, p of x3 equals to 1 by 8 and p of x4 equals to 1 by 8. So what the question is saying is here is a source that generates four symbols x1, x2, x3 and x4 and it will have the probability of p of x1, p of x2, p of x3 and p of x4 whose values are given here and what we need to do is we need to just obtain the information content of each of these messages so let's solve it since we know that the information content that will be given as i of xi that will be equals to log 2 1 over p of xi and here in place of b we are using 2 here that's why the unit of information content will be nothing but bits only now we will use this formula of i of xi that is information content to calculate the information content for each of these messages so let's calculate the information content for message m1 or we can say that x1 so the information content for message x1 will be denoted by i of x1 and its value will be equal to log 2 1 over p of x1 so if we solve it and put the value then i of x1 will become log 2 1 over in place of p of x1 we will write 1 by 2 so here 1 by 2 now i of x1 will become log 2 and this 1 by 2 will come in numerator and become 2 only since we know that log base 2 of 2 will become 1 so the value of i of x1 will be equal to 1 bit so this is the value of i of x1 similarly for the message x2 the information content can be calculated as i of x2 will be equal to log 2 1 over p of x2 so i of x2 will be equal to log base 2 1 over in place of p of x2 we write 1 by 4 so i of x2 will be equal to log 2 and this 4 will come into the numerator part see we can also write i of x2 equals to log 2 this 4 can be written as 2 to the power 2 and according to the property of log this 2 will come in this place so i of x2 will become 2 log base 2 of 2 now this will become i of x2 equals to 2 only because log base 2 of 2 will become 1 only and 1 will get multiplied with this 2 so the final result is 2 bits now let's calculate the information content for message x3 
so i of x2 i of x3 will be equals to log 2 1 over p of x3 similarly i of x3 will be equals to log 2 1 over in place of p of x3 we will write 1 over 8 so 1 over 8 here then i of x3 will be equals to this 8 will come in the numerator so log 2 of 8 so i of x3 will be equals to log base 2 and this 8 can also be rewritten as 2 to the cube so this 3 will come at this position so i of x3 will be equals to 3 log base 2 of 2 and this term will become 1 only so the value of i of x3 will be equals to 3 bits and if you notice then the probability of message x3 will be exactly same as the probability of transmission of probability message x4 that is 1 by 8 and 1 by 8 so we can say that i of x4 will also be equal to this 3 bit so these are the information content for the message x1 x2 x3 and x4 now let us have a look at the question number 2 that is calculate the amount of information if it is given that the probability that is p of k is equal to 1 by 4 so we will need to determine the information content only since we know that the information content is given as i of k because here in the subscript here is written as k that's why we write i of k that will be equal to log 2 1 over p of k and it is given that p of k is equal to 1 by 4 so simply writing the values i of k will become log base 2 1 over 1 by 4 so i of k will be equal to log base 2 this 4 will come in the numerator then i of k will be equal to log 2 and this 4 can also be rewritten as 2 square then i of k will be equal to this 2 will come in the this position and log 2 of 2 since we know that log 2 of 2 is nothing but 1 only so i of k will be equal to 2 bits so this is the value of i of k now let us have a question number third that is in a binary pcm if 0 occurs with the probability of 1 by 4 and 1 occurs with the probability of 1, 3 by 4 then calculate the amount of information content by each bit so what the question is saying that the source that is the binary source emits the two symbol one is 0 and another one is 1 the probability of generation of 0 is 1 by 4 and the probability that 1 occurs is 3 by 4 and we need to calculate the information content only so let's solve it so let p of x is 0 that is the probability of occurrence of 0 is 
वन बाय फोर एंड पी एक्स वन दैट इज द प्रॉबिलिटी ऑफ अकरेंस ऑफ वन इज थ्री बाय फोर दैट इज गिवन इन द क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो सिंस वी नो डैट द इंफॉर्मेशन कंटेंट दैट इज आई ऑफ एक्स आई इज गिवन एज लॉग बी वन ओवर पी ऑफ एक्स आई Similarly, if we calculate the information content for the occurrence of zero, then for occurrence of zero, let's calculate the information content. So i of x zero that will be equal to log base two one over p of x zero. And since we are using the here two, that's why the unit will be equal to bits. Now, let's simply put the values. So i of x zero will become log base two one over in place of p x zero. We write one by four. So i of x zero will become. log base 2 of 4 similarly i of x0 will be equals to log 2 and this 4 can also be written as 2 to the power 2 so i of x0 that will be equals to 2 log base 2 of 2 and this term can be replaced with one only so i of x0 is equals to 2 bits so this is the information content for the occurrence of zero only now let's understand and calculate the information content for the occurrence of one so for occurrence of 1 the information content is denoted by i, I of x1 that is being equals to log 2 1 over p of x1 in bits similarly if we write the values then i of x1 will be equals to log 2 One over in place of p of x one we will write three by four. So i of x one will be equal to log two four by three. Now, how to calculate the value of log two four by three by the help of scientific calculator? Let's do it, guys. So here is the scientific calculator. But here is no option of calculating log base two. So first of all, we have to convert it into log base ten. So this term can be rewritten in the log base ten form as log base ten four by three over log base ten of two. Now we can simply calculate it. That is log. Four by three divided by this log two, and it result into zero point four one five. So the value of i of x one is equal to zero point four one five bits. So this is the information content for the occurrence of one so in this way we can calculate the information content easily by the help of this formula i of xi that is equals to log b 1 over p of xi for any of the questions if you like my content then do subscribe my channel and please hit the like button thank you